Hey guys, what's going on? It's Andy with Acme Packs and I welcome each and every one of you back for a new video. Today is a special day because it is round two of our YouTuber March Madness uh, basketball tournament. So I have an interesting product here today, but we are against two of the funniest guys on YouTube, Chuck and Ed from Silver Sport. Let's get into it. So it is round two of the March Madness YouTuber basketball um, box ripping tournament, if that's what you want to call it, uh, put on by Sage the Collector. So huge shout out to him for putting this all together once again, getting all of us YouTubers together to, you know, do this for the community and have some fun with it. So today we are up against Silver Sport, two of the funniest guys on YouTube. And this is hilarious because... We're both primarily football rippers. So this, we are totally out of our element with basketball. I know a little bit. I know they know a little bit, but this, this is totally out of our element. So in our last video, we did, well, first of all, good luck to them and theirs, but not as good luck as me because I would like to move on. So um, we are going with 2023-24 Panini T-Mall basketball um, NBA hoops. So this is this is an interesting one. Um, definitely well under the price range of two hundred dollars. So two hundred dollars was the um, cap limit for round two. These are coming in at about seventy-five to eighty-five dollars, depending on where you find them. But big hitters in here. You can get some big Wemby pulls in here. And I see four numbered cards per pack on average. With or sorry, four numbered pack, four numbered cards per box um, on average with this product. And you can get cards from 99 down to 10. So you have the um, base hyper or uh, hyper red, hyper green, and hyper gold. So red is going to be to 99. I believe it's to 49 for the green. And then the gold is to 10. And then you can get um, the inserts in go um, those parallels as well. And then you can also have the chance for um, autographs in here. But the autographs are not what we are looking for. We are looking for Wembenyama. So he is the guy that is going to carry us to victory and who we're chasing in this. So if you guys in, have enjoyed this series, enjoyed this um, this tournament, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and also check out Sage the Collector for putting this on. I, again, I can't thank him enough for doing this. It's just a really fun thing that he's done. Um, so really good value here. These are, these are gonna be fun. Saw a few people opening these and I know I had to get in on the fun. Um, taking a risk by going about $120 under the cap on this one, but the value is there and the potential is there. So let's see what we have. Okay. So got some base and then our numbered cards are gonna be towards the back. So let's see what we got. All it's gonna take is probably one numbered Wemby to win it. Um, we got a, a Men Thompson there, very nice. Um, I don't know if this is our numbered card. Let's go behind. Go behind. That's good. Um, we got Brent Shepard and Brandon Miller. I would also take a numbered Brandon Miller as well on the We Got Next. I we obviously not numbered on that one, but let's see what we got. So you get this is going to be our numbered card be, right here, I believe. DeAndre Jordan is going to be our first numbered card. Oh wait, no, maybe it's the one behind. So that is the. Um, team all blue parallel. So that would mean Harrison Barnes. Never mind. I, I lied. <laughs> not a not a numbered card in every pack. I that's kind of what I was seeing though. So I don't know. Maybe we got unlucky there. Unfortunately, not a rookie for either of those either. All it takes is one. All it takes is one. Okay. Got jaw. Really hate it when they have these um, all over the place like this. Hunter Tyson there on the rookie. And then I don't know if this is going to be a number. Josh Giddy. Um, yeah, let's just let's just go through it. Josh Giddy to 99 there. So this is this would be a year three, Josh Giddy. And then we got a LeBron here too. I would have taken another numbered LeBron, but I will take a choice blue. Or not a choice, um, team all blue. Got Ignition, Taylor Hendricks, Kobe Bufkin, and Amen Thompson on the We Got Next. So, definitely a better pack there, but we're going to need bigger. All right. Oops. 
Come on. It's going to be Julian Phillips, rookie for the Bulls. And number two, Jalen McDaniels. Not numbered. So maybe it is only two numbered cards per box. And then Buddy Heald here. Yeah. Unfortunately, only two numbered cards for us. Ignition of Men Thompson again. We got a Marcus Sasser. He now playing. And that's pretty cool. That's like a foil of Jordan Hawkins. That's not numbered, is it? Cool. Yeah, because these aren't supposed to be foil. But we'll take it. Not too bad. Okay. All coming down to this last pack. Come on. Something big. Big auto. Big big numbered card. Something. Needs something here. Okay. This might be an auto here. Let's put that down. Gonna have a Lamello Ball. And that is going to be... Um, 80 of 99 there, so not bad. We need that auto to hit, though. We got your race Walker on the blue for the Pacers. Nice looking card, though. Scoot Henderson on the We Got Next, Asar Thompson, there's his brother, and Ignition, Steph Curry. So we got some nice rookies, but no Wemby, and we know the auto is not going to be a Wemby either. So let's take a look at that. If it's a big, if it's a big auto, we could take it. <clears throat> Autos are not guaranteed in here. R-E-A. Lakers. Austin Reeves. That's actually pretty good. I mean, he just torched the Bucks the other night on the Hoops Inc. Austin Reeves. I mean, he sells. That's a, that's a solid auto to get. There we go. I don't know. I don't know what this is going to comp out to, but I would definitely say this is probably our best card. Um, hopefully, Silver Sport doesn't do as well as we did, so we can move on. And I don't know who we would who we would go against next. But got the Lomelo Ball to 99. Got the Drace Walker on the rookie there. Um, a few other uh, parallels. Got Josh Giddy to 99. So not a bad box by any means. LeBron on the blue. And then we did get a Austin Reeves on the Hoops Inc. with the T-Mall parallel there. So, pretty cool card. Actually a pretty solid box. I mean, this was only an $85 box. So, definitely got a lot of value here. Um, but, let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Let me and Silver Sport know in our comments who won this box battle. And remember to like and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time.